Hello ladies and gentlemen, JT from Above and Below the Belt. Uh, I got another topic talking about um, another boxing match that's, um, that might happen. Uh, Javante Davis and Abner Mar Maras. Um, um, I think it, it might it might just happen. Um, who, now, who I think that's who who you think gonna, who you think gonna win? Who I think gonna win? Um, um, it's it's not gonna be hard. To, it's not it's not gonna it's not it's not hard for me to say this at all. Or to make it real quick, a little bit. Um, they fought a dude called uh, both of them fought a dude uh, Zeus um, uh, Quellar. Um, Javante, Javante Davis stopped him in the third round. Um, it was April the twenty, April the twenty first, um, and um, I think um, Abner Abner Mar Mar Maras. Um, uh, it went to decision uh, with Quillar. Um, it was. The, December the tenth. It was, but it was 2016 when he fought him. But he beat him. He knocked him down too. It, you know, uh, at, um, Abner Mares. Um, the the uh the thing with this, um, Abner Mares is a good. He's a good uh a good boxer, but he's not on um Javante Davies level. Um. Uh, I see uh, Abner Mares, uh records 35 fights, uh, 31 wins, 15 uh, KOs, three losses, and one draw. Whereas um, Javante Davis, hold up, matter of fact, Abner, how old is Abner? He's 32 years old, so he he should be more experienced than Javante Davis. I would say that because he got more fights and and uh, Javante Davis. Um, him being uh, 23 years old, um, 20 fights, uh, 20 wins, and 19 uh, KOs, zero losses. Um, Javante Davis uh, is a uh, uh, he's he's fast and he's he's got he's a strong puncher, a really strong puncher, because he got Quaylor out in uh, the third round, and uh, um, I think it was it was for from a body shot, you know, and um, Abner. Abner Mares, uh, he did okay. He did okay job compared to if we talk about compared to Javante Davis. Javante Davis did a a better job because uh, uh, people would say that because he knocked he knocked he knocked him uh, uh, he TKO uh, uh, Quaylar Zeus Quaylar and um, this fight um, I you know this th th these two fights and Mikey going back to Mikey Garcia and uh, Errol Spence Jr. Um, I think um, Mikey Garcia will have a better chance than beating Errol Spence compared to Abner Mares beating Javante Davis. I just don't think that he has the punching power, and uh, I, I, he's not quicker than Javante because Javante is quicker than him. And uh, that youth man gonna get to him. Uh, he's he should be the most experienced uh guy between Javante Davis, but uh. I don't see him winning this fight. The only way he'll win this fight, he can't fight. He can't. He can't fight Javante Javante Davis. The way he fight uh, Zeus uh, Quaylor, it's just not gonna. It just it, he can't fight Javante Davis like that. Stand up head to head. That's not gonna happen. I don't see that happening. You know what I'm saying? He's gonna have to move around a little bit more than what he did when he was fighting Quaylor. I know that for sure. If he fight him like that, he will lose, and, and it will be a knockout. But um, that's the only way uh, 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 Abner Mares is gonna have a chance to fight uh, beating uh, Javante Davis, beat him on punches. I mean, on points, as in you know, um, moving around the ring a little bit more than what he's doing now. Um, but um, no man, this is uh, I seen in some comments and stuff like that on YouTube talking about Quaylaw is a, a a good puncher. He might be a good puncher, but some people just got your got your ticket. You know, when he was fighting Davis. That was, you know, he was just, he's just a strong puncher, you know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, this fight, if it do happen, um, 
you know, I already know. I think I already know what the outcome is gonna be. I think Javante Davis is gonna knock, gonna, gonna TKO him, knock him out. Um, I don't know what round it's gonna be, but um, it's gonna be a knockout. Ain't somebody's gonna get somebody's gonna get knocked down. I don't think. I, for uh, Abner Abner Mares, I don't think he can knock down uh, Javante Davis. Now he might have a better chance of knocking him down. I would say compared to knocking him out, but I don't see that. I don't see him even knocking him down. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, he's a good boxer. Don't get me wrong, but I don't see that. Um, yeah, this fight, uh, I don't know. Is it going to... Let me see. Matter of fact, yeah, it's not scheduled yet. Uh, it, it might happen pretty soon at the end of this year or probably in the beginning of next year. I don't know. <coughs> we'll see. <coughs> um, yeah. Uh I wonder what y'all think. Uh, like, uh, push, push the like or push the dislike if you don't, if you don't like the video. Or leave a comment and try to but what I said about uh, about this fight between these two uh, boxers, um, Javante Davis and uh, Abner Mares. Um, and um, like I say, um, this is JT from Above and Below the Belt, and uh, I'll holler at y'all later. All right, bye.